and they both sold within hours of posting them. People, I mean, it was crazy. <laughs> Welcome to my channel. I'm Lulu and today in this video I am going to show you my most recent thrift haul, my beauties, my babies. Um, a little info about me. I am a reseller on the apps Poshmark and Mercari. I'm super excited to show you guys this thrift haul. I found seven seven lululemon pieces for forty dollars that's right but yeah um i'm so excited to show you guys this is one of my best those hauls ever luckily i don't know what happened this day but somebody you know donated their entire closet their entire lulu collection and this lady had some good stuff and I just happened to be there at the right time. So first I'm going to show you something that has already sold actually and the other pieces. I've actually already sold a few things. So I'm gonna show you something that's already sold and that I'm gonna actually pack right after this video. So I actually found three pair of smart wool boxers one sold i'm not even kidding you i am not kidding you right now one sold with un under 30 minutes yeah um as soon as i posted it i was getting likes and then uh someone i believe sent me an offer and then i will um of course i will show you guys i'll do a screenshot um and i'll put it in this video but yeah somebody sent me an offer i think it was like 15 dollars and i went ahead and accepted it i'm like yes take it please <laughs> um so uh, my cost of goods for these was actually 50 cents i got three pairs of the smart wool they were all 50 cents each and of course they're used men's underwear so that just gives you some context but yes here's one pair and here is the other pair these two actually sold um within a couple hours after i posted them also these two sold in a bundle um for i'm thinking 17 each um so the bundle was 34 and the caveat to this you guys you're not going to believe this these both have holes in them yeah they sold as is with the holes. I, I took pictures of the holes. I listed it. Um, I wrote it in there and they still sold. So super excited. This is a bolo, obviously. Smart wool is just a bolo. I mean, literally, I couldn't even keep these <laughs> if I wanted to. Like people are like, no, you're give me those. <laughs> Smart wool boxers. If you ever find them um, in the bins or at the thrift, get them immediately. Okay, next we have this beautiful Patagonia. Pretty Patagonia. Um, this is the Diamond Carpa hoodie, fleece hoodie pullover um, in a cream color. Very nice, very beautiful. It's actually flawless. There's really no flaws on this at all. Um, two pockets. And I'm not sure what happened this day, but um, this they didn't mark it up at this thrift store. And my thrift store that I went to, it wasn't Goodwill. It was um, a different thrift store. Um, and the price of this, I believe, was $6. Some of this stuff was in the new bin, was in the new, um, they hadn't even put it on the new rack yet. It was literally in a bin in the thrift store because they hadn't got to it yet. And so me, I'm in there, I'm digging in that bin because I kept pulling out good stuff. So I believe I paid about, the price of this is $6. Um, yeah. This I posted already, it's been getting a lot of attention. I'm just not gonna just give it away though. So whoever makes me the best offer, I'm gonna take that, but 
yeah and i'll show you what i i can do a screenshot of what i actually listed it for isn't it so cute um i just couldn't believe that this was only six dollars so these lululemon pants are a size four these are the groove flare pants i don't know if you can tell on the camera but they are gray I paid $6 for these, so this is a size four. And they're all, there is a little bit of peeling in the back, but it's nothing too bad at all. These are still in great condition. And if you know about Little Lululemon, you know the peeling, it's basically inevitable for these. They all have that. Um, it didn't have the size tag, but the size is in here. And these are the Groove Flare Pants. Next, we have a Free People top. Um, this one has an open back with a tie closure. Um, it's in an orange color. It's like a knit material. This is a small. Um, I've been getting some attention on this. Also, it's super cute. I think, um, I'm, I'm sure, I know it's gonna sell quickly, but I think that I'm gonna model this one. It'll definitely fit me. I'm gonna model this and then I know that it'll sell after that because I, I think people need some context of what it actually looks like on because the hanger just doesn't do it justice. And it's it's a super nice, it's like a th really thick material. It's like knit. Oh, this next one is to die. This next one, this is actually Sundance. Okay, so I've never had a Sundance piece. So when I saw this, I'm like, this is a perfect piece for me to try out. It's um, So it's a sheer top and it's embroidered. I don't know if you can tell. It's like a very dark gray color. And then the embroidery kind of is purple. Like it's actually, it was kind of hard for me to take pictures of this because you just cannot capture the beauty of something like this unless you're in person. It, um, it has a high neck and it has a scallop detail. It has um, two button closure in the back with a little peephole. This is actually a large, I think I'm gonna have to model this one too because you just cannot capture the essence of this. Um, I, I can try to dig, I guess, for a stock photo, but I, I don't think I've looked yet actually. This one is 100% nylon and the embroidery is 100% cotton. And again, this is Sundance. But I've heard um, other resellers talk about this brand, so I wanted to try it. I believe this was like $5. This one you might have seen before. This is a joie top this is the their um kiss top and it's just a uh, white and with red lips on it mm. i've already there's stock photos for this now this one someone took out the size tag so i don't know what size it is um i'll have to measure it and model it and try it on but the way that I knew who it was in the thrift store is um, there's actually a tag here. And then um, this tag actually says joie.com. So that's how I knew who it was. But even still, I knew I like, this is something as soon as I saw it. I'm just getting so good. You guys like spotting things now. And this was also $5. I wish I would have gotten this before Valentine's Day because it would have been perfect, but it's still super cute. It's light and I love it. This little lemon is the Wonder Under High Rise Tight. This is a size six. All of my Lululemon, all of the sizes were cut, all the size tags were cut out, but that definitely does not matter for Lululemon at all. And then the inside, these look like they were like almost, these are like new. And they are like a dark orange color, like a burnt orange. I haven't listed these yet. 
but I know that these are gonna go fast because they're basically like new. Next, we have this Free People plaid pants. I mean, these are so cute. These are so cute. They just give me such like 70s, like, they just give such like vintage vibes. There's the Free People. The um, tag was cut out, the size tag, so I don't know what size these are, but again, I'll measure them, maybe model if I can fit them. This one is Athleta. This is a pullover. Um, it has this zipper here and it's like a, a wrap. This is, this is a large. I'm gonna unzip this for you guys. So this, this is a large, it's absolutely gorgeous. It has a fleece like lining on the inside. This, I mean, this looks super warm. Like you don't have to wear like anything, a coat with this, like it's so comfy. And this has been getting a lot of attention. There is some like peeling, pilling, but it's not bad. It's like, it's just, you can tell it's been in the washer. And I've been getting a lot of attention on this. So I'm pretty sure because the Patagonia and this Athleta are both a large, these definitely came from the same person because they're literally like almost the same thing. So I know that whoever donated that donated this one and it's in a mauve color. And I believe this was also $6 because they hadn't got a chance to put, to price it yet. Okay, and this is also Lululemon again. This is the Wonder Lounge pant. This is super thick. These are super thick and super stretchy. They are in black. These are a size six. The Wonder Lounge. Excellent condition. Again, these were a size six because at this thrift store, they do not, it's not the Goodwill. So they don't mark up Lululemon sky high. They just kind of mark everything the same price. Like women's pants are $6. Women's long sleeve shirts are, you know, the same price. Women's jackets are the same price. So there's really not any individual pricing unless it's like a Gucci purse. Then yeah, they're going to mark that a different price. But most stuff is just kind of the same price. Plus, these were in the new bin, so they hadn't marked it at all. <laughs> Plus, I think if you don't know Lululemon, like it to know what to look for, then you wouldn't know to price it up anyways. Another Lululemon. These are the Groove Pant Flare um, in the navy. This is the true navy. That's the actual uh, Lululemon color. This is a size four. And if you don't know how to find the um, the names, the crazy names of Lululemon, you go to Lulu, is it Lululemon Fanatics or lulufanatics.com? And you just type in the numbers and the letters and it pops right up with the stock photos, the information, the details, all that good jazz. And there really are um lululemon fanatics because as soon as you post a lululemon it's like people are like on it now this does have a little peeling because she obviously loved them she wore them but again excellent condition excellent day reselling condition next we have one of my bread and butters this is Eileen Fisher. This is a size small petite. 100% silk. It has an elastic in the back. But they're just like trousers. Eileen Fisher does good for me. It always sells quickly. I have no issues 
Women love Eileen Fisher. It's a good material all the time. Love it. Ugh, these are like nothing. These are like, <laughs> they're just like, woo, you know. Ugh. God, I wish I could fit these, but. Ugh. Oh, and they have pockets. We love pockets. So these were about $6. Like I said, Eileen Fisher's bread and butter to me. I know some people talk crap about Eileen Fisher. I don't have an issue selling Eileen Fisher. We have Topshop. I've never sold Topshop, so I wanted to test it. Plus, um, I just love these trousers. I do good at selling pants, actually. That's like one of my um, things, my best sellers. I love selling pants. Uh, they're easy to ship, easy to photograph, they're lightweight, there's no issues. You know, some things are just hard to take photographs of and lists, you know, but not pants. And I've never done top shops, so I want to try it. Again, these came from the same people, the same, <laughs> I just know it, because these are a size eight and they have an elastic. I love, whoever donated this lady, I love her. I love her, she had good taste. She had some money to spend on clothes. She kept her clothes in good condition. I like her. I wish I could meet her. Uh, so it has pockets. It has this drawstring. It has elastic waist. Um, again, it is top shop, good condi excellent condition. And it also has the zipper ankle detail. We love those. Have vents. Vince in a size eight. These are 100% linen. No, these are 56% linen, 43% rayon. I just thought they, I thought they were 100% linen because they feel like it. It feels really soft. God, God, Jesus was really with me that day. Got my girl again, my bread and butter. This is Eileen Fisher. These are, again, some black little, like, trousers. Let's see what the material is on these. 100% silk. Again, you just can't. You can't You can't lose with Eileen Fisher. <laughs> you cannot lose with her. Okay, she has two pockets in the front. Elastic waist again. Just some black 100% silk pants. These were $6. These are a small. I just want all the Eileen Fisher, especially the 100% silk, to find a good home. I recently just sold um, an Eileen Fisher, kind of like a tank. It was 100% silk. It was not in the best condition, but Eileen Fisher sells, and I knew someone would like it. Vince. This is a size medium. I know this came from my same lady because it's the same. They're all these pants are literally the same like design. <laughs> these are the elastic waist and they're like comfy trouser type. And these are actually like joggers. They have uh, this cuff. I'm gonna try this brand out because you never know what um, sells good for you unless you try things. So, and then like I said, these were $6, but once you, I'll tell you my cost of goods average at the end. So they were actually less than $6. Oh my God, these I'm obsessed with. These I am obsessed, okay? I went through the shorts because there was just so much good stuff in the store. I'm like, I'm going through every section. These are just top shop. They say Top Shop Moto Mom. Oh, I hope you guys can see that. And so the funny thing about these, the store said that they were a size eight because it says eight here, but I'm thinking that's some other size. I don't know what country that these are in eight in, but definitely not here. And then when I looked closer, once I got home, it says USA four. Now I'm about a four. So I tried these on um, last night actually, because I was gonna take pictures in them. They fit me perfect. 
and they're so flipping cute they're such a like retro like style and so the waist part it like cinches your waist and so it makes your butt look amazing. And then they're kind of like a high rise. So if you can imagine like a high rise cinch waist and then like kind of a flare out where your booty goes and then it's like kind of short under your booty but it doesn't show your booty. And then it has like a raw hemline and then it has this gorge embroidery. These are so cute. These were $5. All of the shorts at that store are $5. Um, so yes, and these have a tag on them because these were actually on the uh, brack. These had already been tagged. But yeah, I'm just like, I kind of wanna keep these. They're so flipping cute. And then when I put them on, and it's so funny because I bought them to sell because I thought they were size eight. So yeah, I just wanted to test, I wanted to test out, I told you I wanted to test out Topshop. So, yeah, $5. Next we have Lululemon again. This is the Freedom Jacket. It's a full zip jacket. Now, I know this came with the other pieces in this Lulu collection, but, but they did, uh, this one had been tagged. So this one was $6. It was actually on the um, racks. It was out on the floor, but I did snag it. I told you after I found all that good stuff in that bin, on the new bin, I'm like, I need to go through these racks. So I did get this one. Like I said, it's the Freedom Jacket. It's a full zip. And it's really like a fitted jacket. And there is the little lemon. It has two zip pockets in the front. And it's an excellent, perfect, like new condition. It's a size six. All of the Lululemons I found were four or six. And then this is their black camo um, print for this jacket. Gorge, gorge. If you want this, it's listed in my Poshmark or my Macari, and I will put those in the description down below. I love this. It really doesn't fit me. So, but yeah, gorge. Current Elliot. Like I said, I am trying out brands that I've never done before. Um, I really want to, you know, uh, expand my knowledge and do my research and my due diligence. I thought these would be a good pair to test out. These are the buddy pants. And they're like a camo green. They just feel really nice too. That's what drew, drew me to them. They're 100% cotton and they are a size 30. I want to give you guys the full name of these. These are the Buddy Trouser Pantalon. Wait, the Buddy Trouser Pants. This is Soft Surroundings. I hear people talk about these all the time. I know this brand is bread and butter for some people, some resellers. When I saw this, I'm like, this would be a good design to test out. It's a cold shoulder blue tie-dye. Um like a, I don't know if it's a tunic. This is an extra large and this one was $6. They said it was a long sleeve. So that's why they put it at $6. I wouldn't call this a long sleeve. I would call that a half sleeve, a uh, three fourths sleeve, but whatever. It's still $6, it's not bad. Do, 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 do. I did find the stock photo for this. I can't model this. It would just look crazy on me because it's an extra large, but I really like it and I can't wait to try it out, see how it does. I saw the comps online. They were kind of all over the place for this one. And I believe there's two other extra larges on Posh right now. They are from 36 to 38. 
as the listing price. So I believe I just listed mine as like 25 because I just kind of want to see, like I don't, I'm not really, like I said, all of this other stuff is <laughs> definitely going to cover this. So I'm not really worried about it. And I've already sold five things from this haul already that I can't even, you know, show you guys. And we have these, They are made in Italy. They are in eight. Let me get that. They are in eight and a half off white creamish um, leather loafer. I looked up comps. Um, comps look pretty good. I will definitely make some money from these. Not a ton, but I could just tell that they were like quality shoes. And when I looked up comps, comps look good. These are an eight and a half and they were five dollars i just as soon as i saw them i knew there was something like just the details and the design of course the vero curio or however you say it the it means you know leather and made in italy is always good and the bottom let me come on. now i do have to tell you about the things that have already sold so i also had two pair of lululemon shorts they were the hottie hot shorts i mean this the, the tiniest shorts you had ever seen they were both a size four one was a lavender color which lavender as the reseller community knows is the color of 2022 <laughs> anything lavender is just selling people are loving that color um lavender or lilac um, so there was a lavender and a black pair and they both sold within hours of posting them people I mean, it was crazy. So those are definitely um, Bolos the lululemon shorts and the smartwell boxers they sell within hours So yeah, that is everything um, I'm obsessed I'm obsessed. I did so good this day. I'm still learning. I'm still an amateur. I'm still a newbie. Um, I do a lot of research. I watch a ton of other resellers. That's the only way I knew about any of these brands. <laughs> That's the only way I know how to like look for quality, how I know how to feel things. Just like even like before I knew that these silk pants were Eileen Fisher, I felt them and I knew. I now I know like how to tell quality materials just by looking at them or just by feeling them. So yes, and I'm excited about all the Lululemon. I just I wish I could meet whoever donated seven pieces of Lululemon. I wish I could shake her hand. Uh, not in the Corona, maybe like a fist bump. But yeah, anywho, thank you for watching. Um, please like, comment, and subscribe. Tell me what your favorite piece from my haul was. Um, I had so much fun thrifting these things. Oh, my dress. My dress is Calvin Klein. Hold on, let me show you guys. Do the full view. Calvin Klein. I thrifted this. Um, I believe it was like $8. I absolutely love it. I think I had thrifted this dress to resell, but then when I tried it on, it fit me like a flipping glove. And it looks like I had it tailored and I didn't. This is just how it was in the thrift store. Like, that's why I tell you guys, thrift, thrift, thrift. Anywho, um, I have to pack some things and I have to go to a consignment shop. So I have a busy day ahead. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, please subscribe. Please like. Please comment. Mwah.